Hi, it's Renee. Welcome to my Seasons Greetings Card Kit. All the supplies used to make this card are listed right here, and you can get them while supplies last on my website, reneemcbarron.closetomyheart.com. All right, pull out your kit, and let's get making this really fun card. To start with, we're going to stamp the fireplace. And what's so fun about this stamp set is that there are a bunch of different fireplace pieces. So you can create and design your own fireplace. Just really cute, really fun. Now the thin cuts that are included in this stamp set um, is the fireplace itself and as well as the garland that I cut out in the pine cardstock. So I'm doing the mantle in black just to tie in that, the other black pieces that are used in this set. Um, when I do the hearth and the, it's like the background of the fireplace, I'm doing it all in linen and then just the hearth itself, I stamped again in charcoal just to get that extra color. To do the fire, I inked it up first in Sundance and then I just rolled the outer edges in the candy apple red. So we get that more fire, you know, <laughs> movement look with that. Okay, now we're just gonna add in our um, grate and the pieces that go with your fireplace <laughs> and let's start building. All right, so this Home for Christmas, we're gonna use the plaid on this one. So adhere it to your card base, and then you're going to want to take the piece that um, we're gonna have the green up, and it's just gonna go in the middle of the card. And then the zip strip, I love this black gingham zip strip so much. So I've cut you two pieces, and one's gonna go above that middle piece and one below it and then some shimmer trim just kind of dog ear the sparkly part towards you that helps you get that plastic off and then just trim off the excess okay you're going to adhere the sentiment to this pine cardstock and then just adhere it to the center left of the card and then you'll want your thin 3d tape for the fireplace itself and it's just gonna go on top of that French vanilla piece. And then um, in your kit, you've got that little teeny piece of garland. So it's so tiny, it's a little bit tricky, but I went ahead and used my tape runner, but if you have like a little quickie glue or something like that, that'll work great on there too. And then you're just gonna line it up, the bows with the top of the mantle and then once you get that on your card, your card is done. How cute and how fun. What a fun stamp set. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.